Now, one thing to be very aware of, particularly with the saltwater aquarium, is what's called dissolved oxygen level and redox potential. Now, for an aquarium like this, I'll usually want around 10 to 20 times an hour water flow. Now, that does not necessarily mean 10 to 20 times an hour through the filter. It just means agitation and water flow in the aquarium itself. Now, this aquarium's got an outlet there. So it is providing some little bit of surface agitation. But particularly as you get more and more fish in the aquarium, those fish are going to reduce your oxygen level and therefore reduce your redox potential. Your redox potential is your filter's ability to reduce or break down your nutrients. And that can be measured in millivolts. So you've got a bunch of fish making the oxygen and redox go down. Now, the other thing to be aware of is these lids are very well tight fitted now tight fitting lids means that oxygen can't readily get into the top of the tank now they're definitely not sealed but they are relatively tight fitting which which is just a point then the water goes down through there gets a little bit of agitation going back into the aquarium going into the sump down here now here you've got your biomedia so you've got some fake marine pure here. I would much rather go with real marine pure. I get much better parallel denitrification in the marine pure than the fake marine pure. Then the water goes through here. So you've got a whole lot of bacteria here, which is making the oxygen go down. Then you go into that return pump, which is shooting the water back up to the top again. So the amount of surface agitation for such a large volume of water is actually very low. So if this was my tank, the first thing I'd do is go and get myself a power head and I'd want to place it on the back, something like an Aqua L 8000 or something like that. That'll agitate the surface, give much better water flow, give much better surface agitation. I'd make sure these lids are not complete. So like even if you cut the corners out of them or allow oxygen into the top, that's something I'd like to do. And I would be much more confident putting a lot more flow into this aquarium. That's going to dissolve, r raise the dissolved redox the, the dissolved oxygen and redox potential, which is very easy issues to overlook and super super important.